I came up with the best way to mine fast in Hypertil Skyblock. It's both cheap and works so well, almost too well. When I first entered the mines, I had no idea what the heck I was doing, and progress was slow, oh so slow. But now, I am drowning in all the loot because I unlocked the secret to speed. And how did I do this? Well, it all started with me getting a piece of the goblin set from one of the goblins and the dwarven mines. You know, one of those green degenerates that make absolutely vile sounds. <laughs> I read up on the effect of the full armor set, and basically it turns every 15 intelligence you have into one mining speed. Hmm, this does have some potential. I can definitely work with this. If I just get Wisdom 5 and some other stuff that boosts intelligence, this might actually be a viable option for mining. So that's what I did. I started by getting a full goblin set from the auction house and reforging all of it to wise. It was perfect. The better reforge option is, of course, necrotic, since more intelligence. But I'm trying to save up as many coins as possible for my video about the garden update. And boy, let me tell you, that shit ain't cheap. So wise will do just fine for the time being. So you can either use a pickaxe like a total pleb or a drill. Drills go brrrr and pickaxe go... Yeah, it doesn't go anywhere. <laughs> but either way, I added a goblin omelette to the drill, because apparently that slowly gives you back free fuel. I also added a drill engine to my gemstone drill, because I didn't have one attached, and they add a lot of mining speed. I decided to go with the mithril plated one, which took like one or two days to make in the forge. I then acquired myself a nice Wisdom 5 book from the bazaar, and holy fuck is that expensive. I guess the people want it for stuff, because like mages, but please, 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 I just want to play the funny block game, please, I don't want to become broke. After like spending half of my bank account in one sitting, I pondered over my decisions in life, and then I decided to scrap the idea of getting smarty pants or big brain. But if you want to mine even faster, you should get them. But I still had some things to do that didn't cost me immense amounts of coins. No, these things would cost something else entirely. That being my happiness and time. I was about to mine Mithril and do commissions for the Dwarven King. This is because doing commissions and mining Mithril gives you Mithril powder, which you can use to upgrade your Heart of the Mountain. And one of the upgrades, the almost, I think it's the first one, is mining speed. It has 50 tiers and it gives you a lot of mining speed, so it's it's crucial for my build. Also, when you're mining Mithril, there's a chance uh, a block of titanium will spawn in, which I can turn into a titanium talisman, ring and artifact, and you can make these by refining titanium in the forge. I also made sure to go to the Crystal Hollows to interact with the locals in the Goblin Hideout. I was going to become one of them after all. I made sure to loot any chests that I could find and acquire some goblin eggs for the future too. So if you don't know what the Crystal Hollow says, it's basically an exclusive instance version of the Dwarven Might. You can buy a pass to go there and it costs 10k coins and it basically lasts for a few hours and you need a specific Heart of the Mountain tier to be able to buy it. While I was there, I made sure to mine as many amber and sapphire gemstones as I could, because I wanted to socket these into my goblin armor. Basically, what socketing does is that it gives you the stat of the gemstone, uh, so amber gives you mining speed, and sapphire gives you intelligence. And basically, I needed to get as many of these gemstones as possible to refine them, or like, craft them into better ones, so they go from rough to perfect. Then, I made sure to invest all my tuning points, you know, the stuff you get from accessories, into intelligence because I am just smart like that. And then I equipped the good old sheep pet, that is still not level 100 by the way, but at least it has the textbook, which nets me around 200 intelligence. And finally, it was time, time to equip the armor, put on the mask, and go goblin mode. And it sucked. Like sure, it was faster, like by a lot, but still too slow for my liking. I want to break stuff in one hit, or maybe even like one second, and I don't want to commit to getting a fucking gemstone gauntlet, because <laughs> because I have a life. <laughs> Unlike all the nice and welcoming people that do mining in Skyblock. So I went back to the goblin holdout in the crystal hollows. I was farming eggs, I was mining gemstones, I was making bank. Wow, a whole coin? No, but actually, all the money I had spent, I made back. And I made even more than that. And now I was fast. 
fast enough to be able to form the gemstone gauntlet fairly easily. And this, dear viewer, is where I ascend to Gobhood. No, not Godhood, Gobhood. I shall leave you mere mortals with your thoughts. And if you enjoyed this video and you want to see more, then please let me know in the comments. Ideas are always appreciated. Take care until I see you the next time. Oh my god, that voice was so annoying to make.